Hi guys, I'm, uh, I'm now trying out the Chimera wand. Uh, it's really uh, nice to hold in the hand, it's quite comfy. Um, I've trained it to, for a few things, like um, to turn the TV on, just suppose like this. There you go, just a forward jab and then it turns the TV on. Um, I'll move back a little bit. Um, to to uh, turn the volume down. It's just a case of, there you go, turn the volume up, to change the channel for the input, just pull it back a bit, there you go, and do it again, and that's the channel, that's the channel for the PS3, that's all I've got on it so far, but it's really, it can do up to 13 different um, like methods. 13 different like functions of the wand and it is really cool um, to put it in learning mode all you've got to do is just tap the crisscross bit for no just tap it upright twice and then you press the button directly opposite the, the wand on the remote and it is really cool just um, just turn it off with a jab so if I, I've got like three remotes and so if I need to like if I can't find any of the three remotes I just use this thing and it is pretty damn cool. Ah, uh, there you go. So yeah. Another shot. Yeah, just grab it and then just it's got to be right under. I think. I think it's got to be the hand that's programmed in. Not that loud. Oh, this is sleeping. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. Yeah, I know right. You gotta wait for it to go. Wait for it. Wait for the TV. Gotta do it. The one doesn't like me. There you go. <laughs> the one doesn't like me. I don't even You can have about 13 different. Um, so obviously there's more advanced ones like tapping on the side of the wand, but I've not programmed any of those yet. And, uh,. Do not think it's what? I'm not. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> but yeah, um, the one tells you that you've done the motions right with a little pulse in the hand. And uh, yeah. The wand itself was really detailed. It's mm -hmm. quite de quite well detailed. You know, it's like I said earlier, it's kind of plasticky, but it is. you can tell it's quality as well. So yeah, it's a little demonstration, and I'll just change the channel. Back again once it comes back on. There you go. So yeah, um, I've not tried it with the Sky Remote yet. I've only used it for the. Jesus Christ! <laughs> down, down, down. <laughs> uh, yeah. So yeah, I'm not gonna. I've not tried it with the Sky Remote yet. Only the the default TV um, remote that came with the TV. But yeah, um, I'll. That's the remote that I used it with, and it is just a case of maybe put it when you're holding the wand, just do the motion that say you wanted it to do, like that. Then um, just press the button after you've done the wand motion, and uh, yeah, and it explains everything. It's so clear in the instructions as well. It couldn't be more clear. It even gives you a bit of some suggestions on what to do. Like uh, you don't have to have the volume. As uh, you don't have to have the volume as that, you can have the volume as that if you want. They like just twist and turn it. So yeah, it was really cool, and I highly recommend it. I've got another cool thing coming, uh, like wand remote control related, but it's not the TV thing. But yeah, you'll see that soon enough. Okay, right, talk to you guys later. Bye.